Welcome back to the Crafty Seas. I'm on today to share with you the Crafter's Companion Advent Calendar. I was going to share it during the Christmas period but forgot to so whilst we're tidying away our Christmas craft items I thought I would pop on and share this beautiful Advent Calendar with you. So this was the Crafter's Companion Advent Calendar and it came in this lovely box that was tied together with a ribbon and it had a Christmas tree theme with little mice and nutcrackers. Unfortunately, the box hasn't lasted very well and some of the items have fallen out. So instead of going through each day with you, I'm just going to open them all randomly and show you the items that come out. And at the end, I'll lay them all out on the table so that you get an idea of the full content. So without further ado, I will start at this side and get unboxing. So the first thing I pulled out is this beautiful gold and silver ribbon, always handy for a crafter. And in this one here, we have a thank you stamp. A nice little butterfly stamp. Best wishes and another butterfly stamp. That was a lot in that, but as I say, they might be a little bit mixed up as when we had our advent calendar on display like this, some of the items did fall through. And if you like advent calendars, make sure to check out our other advent calendar unboxing video by the Stamp By Me advent calendar. And in this one here, we have some beautiful iridescent glitter. Again, a very useful crafting item, so pleased with that. And this calendar only came with 24 days. It didn't have 25. And last year's one had a paper pad in it. But spoiler alert, this one didn't. So here we have a lovely little 2D embossing folder in a swirly pattern. These can be quite tricky to use because they are relatively small, but I'm sure we'll think of something to make with them. And I'll keep unboxing. And in this one here, we have a cute cupcake, birthday cake and candle. And it came with a coordinating die, which I really love. It saves you fussy cutting it out. So again, a very useful and handy crafty item. And also I love the fact that so far they aren't all Christmas related, which means we can use them all year round. And as I said, some of them have slipped out. So this long edgeable was actually day number 24. A nice rose edgeable. And in here we have a little Easter bunny popping out an egg. Perfect for spring crafting, which the year's just flying in, so it'll almost be time to start Easter and spring crafting. So we'll keep that out on our craft tray. And this one has another beautiful stamp with the watering can and flowers. Again, a beautiful springtime stamp. And, oh dear, some things seem to have slipped into this one because it's at the bottom. But we have a heart stamp and matching die and a little floral stamp and die. I love the fact they come with the die. I'm really appreciative of that. As I said, it saves us fussy cutting anything. And is there anything? Oh, yep. We have some more dies here. And this looks like an Easter egg die. So the stamp that matches hopefully will be somewhere in here. Another embossing folder. This one's a nice leopard print. And down the bottom here, we have more dies. So we have a balloon die and the stamp for the string, some banner, and what looks like a little carrot die. So as I said, some of them have slipped out. So I'll just double check nothing's hiding. Oh, 
what do we have here? Some 3D glitter glue and a lovely sparkly silver. Always handy glitter glue. And yep, I think that's everything from that side. So some embossing folders, some stamps and dies, glitter, glitter glue. A great mix. So we'll continue over to the other side of the advent calendar now. And you can let us know, did you buy a crafty advent calendar this year? Have you tried the Crafter's Companion one in the past? And did you have a good Christmas period? We love to hear from you, so please do drop us a little comment below and let us know what you've been crafting. And in here we have an embossing folder again. And this is a beautiful leaf design. That will be nice in our autumn crafting. So, so far, a really good mix of crafty items for all year round crafting. And aha, here is the missing carrot and Easter egg that we found the die for earlier. Another cute little autumn themed pumpkin wheelbarrow. A mini pumpkin that's super cute and perfect for Halloween or autumn crafting. And some coordinating dies for the pumpkin and the leaf. Fabulous. So, let's see. The only thing is with the calendar, unfortunately, it was pretty difficult to open the doors. And as you can see, some of them came off in the process. So, unfortunately, we won't be able to reuse this next year. And here we have a lovely floral stamp. And these are a cute size, great for ETCs or smaller cards, perhaps. And I think that was this stencil was in this one here. Nice Christmas themed stencil. And in here we have, if I can get it out. Another stencil with a kind of abstract heart pattern. Oh, Halloween, yeah! We have Christmas, birthday, Halloween and Easter stamps. Very versatile. And a die that says happy. Perfect, so you can do happy Christmas, happy birthday, happy Halloween and happy Easter. Really great all year round craftable items in this advent calendar which is fantastic so i would say that in my opinion it is a very versatile advent calendar it's not just christmas themed and you get a lot of stamps and dies for your money and here we have a little set of birthday presents or parcels again with the coordinating mini dies fantastic and being this small size, they can also fit through our Gemini Mini, which is great for crafting in bed or if you're watching TV. See if you're getting out your large machine, so ideal. And we're getting there. I hope you've got a little cocoa to sip on. And I'll continue sharing this lovely advent calendar with you. Next up, we have this super cute snowman stamp i don't think there's a die for this one unfortunately but i'm sure we'll be able to fussy cut him and a snowflake perfect for christmas so we've got christmas easter birthdays all sorted thanks to this advent calendar um, hiding in here we have a beautiful star die this coordinating die for the stamp that we found earlier and a lovely just for you sentiment and that looks just about the right size for one of our circle punches lovely and have we got any doors left to open Oh, we have another embossing folder hiding up the top here. Oh, as you can see, it was a little bit tricky, the opening of this advent calendar. Gorgeous, beautiful butterfly and rose. But again, quite a small size, but 
I'm sure we'll be able to think of something for it. And last but not least, we have a mix of gold and silver charms. Beautiful. A little pumpkin, a flower, a snowflake and a sun. So something for all year round. So I've laid all the items from the advent calendar out on the table. And I think you'll agree that there's a great variety of items. We have some lovely dies, stamps and dies, some stencils and lots of lovely embossing folders as well. So a great variety of different craft techniques that we can try and also all year round crafting from cute little Easter bunnies to birthday cupcakes, glitter that we can use at Christmas, ribbon, you name it. I think they've included it in this advent calendar and we were thoroughly pleased with it and we'll definitely be buying another one next year. A huge thank you for watching along with us today. I hope you enjoyed the unboxing and until next time, happy crafting.